Hello, ladies and gentlemen, we're back to the third part of this lovely little Warlord series. Um, I hope you guys are enjoying it. As you can see, we had to consolidate some positions, but I believe that we should be doing pretty good because... Once we get that fallback line securely placed, everything should be tip top. So, um, what? If you could share with me the name of that song, because that sounds pretty interesting there. Why? <laughs> um, that was not my intent to sound like that. Well, I will say that's kind of what it sounded like. <laughs> there we go. We're gonna fix this. Fix oh, this trouble? the way it's meant to be. Uh, you know, if you look to the north, you would obviously clearly understand the answer to that question is no. Uh, that's, that's Japan. I'm asking you. Uh, no, I am providing to be a distraction. I never expected to be able to take on the whole entire brute force of China. So, yes, for what I was purposed to do. Yes, I am. Oh, I see the war is escalating in the West. France has taken over, uh, us poison, or well, some of it. I uh, haven't seen that one before. That is certainly interesting. I think Germany will quickly lose this war, especially since there is no Mussolini. <laughs> yeah, unless they don't. They are quite powerful when you look at the division count. What's this? Japan taking more land from the nasty Chinese? A Japanese cav division about to take the capital of Shangxi and capitulate them? <laughs> As Shangxi thinks that they're pushing in the north, they're actually just going to get encircled and have their capital taken? Yes, I like, I like. And it looks like they're pulling away most of their troops in the south because they're realizing that there's a bigger threat in the north <laughs> than my tiny country, my small country. Oh my goodness, I've never seen a Japanese victory this severe. Yeah, it's only because of you in the south. I know. But <laughs> there will soon be a breakthrough. Oh, will there be a breakthrough now? Yes, indeed there will. Well, now that Japan, uh, I mean, now that China has literally just started to go down their political tree, that allows them to um, do their whole war of resistance thing and form the United Front. Oh, I see. Well, see, there's ex escalation. There goes the dream of the war being over anytime soon. And France is totally taken that territory. You know, like Italy's pushing in. Oh no, that's not good. Actually, never mind. I fight for the Axis. So, that's good. I have two brothers and they are at rest. Their arms are full. Did on their chest. Now, who are you talking about now? That was the song I was singing earlier that you insulted. Yes, I do. Once Shang Xi is dealt with, China will be crushed. We just have to deal with Shang Xi first. I like that I have literally lost 10k men. It is good. Ooh. Ooh. 
Ooh. Ooh. All right. Well, this requires some work, I see. Allow me to establish my front lines. I now. What? You can wait. Now, time for me to establish my front line. I hope you know that you still stand no chance. We'll see about that. Anyway, let's see here. There is no point. Your situation is hopeless. I see that you are one that gives in. Too easily. Looks like you gave in to the Chinese. The Japanese. Mm -hmm. You are a disappointment to China. Mm -hmm. But I will not. Mm -hmm. Alrighty then. You ready to go then? Oh, I suppose. We should probably slow it down. Mm, no, I have been going for speed for this war, and you shall too. Hmm, yes, we are holding the Japanese at the river. Now the Soviet Union should wish to send me supplies. Oh, what's that? Industry? Whoa, forgot if, all about that. If only you would, if only it would actually help you. The yeah, my French capitulated to Italy. <laughs> Surprising news. Il Duce was hurriedly flown in to participate in the victory of parade. Hmm. I know not why you think that you have any chance of winning, because all I see is your men retreating. It's because the reserves are being called up on. Oh, like you're taking their sweet time just walking over here. Like you have many reserves. Oh yeah, sure. They're going to lose all of China, and we will push the you German to... Republic. <laughs> <laughs> well, Ooh, okay, that's pretty spicy there. What? Uh... I have never seen that before. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't believe I have either. And remember, this is vanilla. <laughs> Herman Goring, wow. <laughs> Alrighty then. That's that's strange right there. <laughs> I see, when you finish this focus, are you going to change your name to China? Yes, I think so. Hmm. Now I get the Chinese one. Hmm. So now you are China. I am China. Thinking emoji. I do have to say that. And when you lose all those divisions encircled near Ningbo, now that. Oh yes, that will be very, very appetizing for me. I'll enjoy feasting on their corpses. And let me just pluck Shanghai from your fingers. North and South is about to come together. And it will be the greatest encirclement, which is why I recommend you retreat all your troops west. <laughs> oh. oh, my emperor, how good this is. Yes, China has taken quite the beating, and how much have I lost? <laughs> 19,000. That is... That is very good. Those are the kind of numbers that I want to see. And that... clears up the Eastern Front. Alrighty. Well, he has seemingly disappeared off. We might have scared him in. Maybe he's in hiding somewhere in a, around Golmud. He's trying to hide. But we will pull him out of his uh, little foxhole. 
and we will proclaim victory over all of China. But, if you guys have enjoyed it so far, I think this is probably the most eventful episode we've had. Um, yeah. Stay tuned for more. I think in the next episode, we'll probably end up finishing him off, and we'll see how China gets divided up. And that might be the end of the little series, because this is, again, for the 25 subscriber milestone. This is the co-op series. Uh, it's not going to be a long one. I just figured we would fight over, be warlords, and fight for dominance in China. So thank you everybody for watching. If you like this little co-op series, uh, please be sure to support it by liking, maybe even subscribing. I hope everyone's had fun so far in this series, as I have, and I'll see you guys all in the next episode.